Let's fix this Google error called too many fails attempts as well as unavailable because too many fails attempt and Google asks you to try again within few hours. So if you follow my methods correctly, you can recover your account immediately without getting this annoying message. First, I will show you what's the problem. To start, you can use your Google application like that. Then either you can go to search bar or you can just tap add another account. Then you can enter your email ID like this. Then just tap the next button to go forward. Then it asks you to enter your password. Since I can't access or don't remember our password, just tap try another way option like this. Then again, when you just tap try another way, it asks you to use your phone. Since I can't use another device, I will just tap try another way. Then get a verification to Google authentication application. That option is not possible too. So I will just tap try another way. Again, you can see the backup code option is available as well as you can get a verification code to your phone number. So if you add a recovery phone, you can just tap that one. Then now just wait a few seconds. Then Google needs to verify your phone. So you can just tap the continue to go forward. This is the problem we get. When you try to use our recovery phone number or email address, we will get this error call too many fails at it. Now this option is unavailable because you tried too many times and it asks you to use this recovery option after few hours. In that case, just tap try another way. Now you can see that recovery phone option is not available as well as if you go forward, if you try to get recovery code via email, the same problem will be appeared. Unavailable because too many fails at him. So in that case, we can't sign back into or log back into our account. You will continuously get this error message. So this is how to fix it. Close all these application one after another like this. After closing all this application, swipe down to the notification bar. Again, swipe down to get the full view. Then you can switch between your network. If you are using mobile network, you can switch to familiar Wi-Fi network. So if you are using Wi-Fi network, you can switch to mobile network. Like that, you can switch between your networks. Then I recommend you to turn on your location permission. Then Google can track your location and Google confirm you are the real owner of this account. So these are the simple changes as well as earlier we use our Google application. So this time we use our browser. So here you can use any of these browser. Before you use a browser, you can make these changes. So take a long press on your browser. Then you will get another pop-up window. In the pop-up window, you will get this app info option. Just tap it. Then you will get the that application permission. So here I recommend you to allow all these permission like this allow all these permission one after another then you can close this application after that you can use your web browser here i recommend you to use your default web browser it doesn't matter which browser that you use but i recommend you to use the default one then go to search bar now type and search google recovery account support after that you will get this kind of search result. Google account help under support.google.com. Just select that one. Then you will be redirected to Google help window. Here, under describe your issue, you can just type and search how to recover your Google account or under popular articles, you can select this one. How to recover your Google account or Gmail. Just tap it. By the way, if you couldn't find this one, I will put this link in the description too. Then you will redirect it to another window. Here, scroll down until you find forgot your password. Now just tap recover your Google account or Gmail in blue color link. Then you will get this recovery page. Here, enter the email ID that you want to go to recover. Tap the next button. Now it asks you to enter your password. Since you don't remember your password or if you can't find out it, just tap try another way. Then it asks you to use another device here. If you tap yes in another device, 
it will get a pop-up notification all you have to do just tap yes in that device but if you couldn't find another device you can just tap try another way to see is there a new verification like this one you can use authentication application if you have turned on two-factor authentication as well as you can use your backup code here you can see recovery with your mobile number option is available you can get a recovery code via sms then you can recover your account as well as if you tap try another way it allows you to get a recovery code via email too you can select your recovery email address or alternative email address then they will send a one-time verification code as well as if you tap try another way it asks you to add a new contact details here you can enter new phone number or email address in my case it asks me to enter new email id then this new email id will be your new recovery email id after that they will send a verification code you have to verify this email id like that you can fix this too many fails attempt problem by adding a new email id or you can get a verification code to your all recovery email or phone number then you can face the code then you can tap the next after that they will send a recovery link within next few hours like this just tap this recovery link then you can easily create a new password and log back into your account but using this method if you could fix this problem i invite you to watch the alternative tutorials you can find those tutorials in this video description or you can click this end screen videos and come on over that's it for today's tutorial see you in the next one later